networking, collaboration, uh, collaborating, sharing insights, and celebrating innovation, among others, have been identified as key attributes that drive Africa's tech, tech ecosystem. Now, this was at the crux uh, at a tech event tagged Moonshot by Tech Cabal, held on Wednesday in Lagos, Nigeria's commercial new NERV center. Uh, new Central's correspondent Bettina Unweli was there and now reports. Industry leaders, innovators and entrepreneurs gathered in Lagos for the much anticipated tech event of the year. The aim of the conference is to showcase Africa's burgeoning talent and capabilities in the tech sector. Because Nigeria, for some funny reasons, is rated as one of the lowest countries when it comes to the ECI trade index for technology which means we're not exporting technology, and that's a fat lie, as we all know. Bosu Tijani emphasized the importance of collaboration between African startups and international partners, highlighting success stories that demonstrate the potentials of homegrown solutions. We need to ensure that it's meaningful connectivity. By meaningful connectivity, we're saying if there's a young person in Sanfara, they don't need to leave Sanfara to go to Kano or the Yara Lagos for them to be part of the global digital economy. They can create value in Sanfara and connect to the digital economy. If government is providing services online, uh, you don't need people to leave their location to actually be able to consume what government is providing. Or a technology news platform or a learning platform that is based out of Lagos, they should be accessible to everyone. The convener expressed optimism about the future of African tech, urging stakeholders to invest in innovation and talent development. We'll inevitably claim some jobs. But it, what they always do is they change the nature of work. So they create opportunities, they remove things. If you think about it, 20, 30 years ago, social media manager was not a job. Content creator was not a job. And so there are opportunities, there are things that each technology revolution brings. And I think it's why you need a government and you need a startup ecosystem that's very thoughtful and active in finding new opportunities, finding new ways for us to generate economic value, finding new ways to create jobs. Because if you ignore it, you know, and say, let's wait for this thing to pass us by. The whole world will pass us by, and we don't want that. The message is clear. Africa is ready to take its place on the global tech stage with a commitment to building for the world. In Lagos, for New Central, I'm Bettina. Mm -hmm.